One uh, astronomer described it as a curtain of doom, and suddenly you're immersed in the shadow. When you see a total eclipse, you will realize for the first time what the meaning of awesome is. Bailey's Beats! Totality! Because an eclipse is awesome. Everything else is mundane. My name is Fred Espinac. I'm known as Mr. Eclipse because of all the work I've done on eclipse prediction and eclipse observations and eclipse photography. And I've been to all seven continents to see total eclipses of the sun. Probably one of the uh, most memorable eclipses I had was to India in 1995. I was with a tour group of about 30 people and in, in fact uh, there was one woman on the, on the trip who had been trying to see an eclipse for 20 years. And I just said, hmm. <laughs> nice hair. <laughs> you know, I thought, huh. <laughs> like you did. There's an interesting guy. And, you know, then it just, it just went from there. You thought I was funny. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I prefer Ms. Eclipse to Mrs. Eclipse, but we, we argue about that sometimes. Fred and I have been married for about 10 years, and we've been together about 20 years, so it took him a while, but we finally made it. After I retired, Pat and I moved out to a, a place called Arizona Sky Village. It's a village designed for people who have a love of the night sky. In order to get away from city lights, which plague most of the country, we've had to abandon civilization, so to speak. And I've always wanted to live someplace where I could go out and really see the Milky Way any night. Probably the most stunning thing to see here, even without a telescope, is the Milky Way. And you can see all these features looking out into the Milky Way at night, and especially through photography that can reveal things much fainter than we can see with the naked eye. I think it's wonderful to be married to somebody who has a passion. I do. So many people, I feel, I don't know, they watch too much television, or they just spend too much time being a passive observer instead of going out into the world. I think I'm that kind of a person too, but he's made it very easy for me to be that kind of a person. Oh, she, sometimes I take myself too seriously. <laughs> and she makes me laugh. <laughs> All my world travels with, with solar eclipses has, has given me a, a greater acceptance to appreciate the diversity of the people of this planet. But we've got to learn to, to live together. Do I think we're alone in the universe? Well, somebody, it might have been Carl Sagan, that said that uh, if in this vast universe we're the only ones, um, it's a colossal waste of space. 